Okay, there are some mods for H3. It's beta, so don't play with it if you're not uh, prepared to have trouble with your phone that time. It's called a Hignick mod, H3 version 7.9, and it's for the 2407-02 uh, version. There is one for the 06 uh, June. It's on GitHub, Nixure, that's N-I-C-S-U-R-E forward slash T-D hyphen H3 engineering. Let me just uh, zoom in on that. I think you can see that. There we go. Okay. I'll show you what it does. Let me just see. You have to do is you hit the blue to go to menu and then hit the push to talk and then keep hitting the blue to cycle and you have uh, the op these are the options that you have i haven't tested the uh, usb and am yet prevent kill basically uh, you can't kill the phone <laughs> and Fine tune, I got off for now. Mod hooks, I allow. Um, set it to block if uh, there's some issues. Tone monitor enable. It will display the tone. Uh, your battery display is percentage instead of an icon. The uh, signal bar is segmented. Frequency adjusts. And I, th I believe this is the uh, wireless uh, copy. Use the default. Switch VFOs, your push to talk option. Um, I'll demonstrate that when I hit it. Okay, hit the orange to get out. Now, notice the green arrow. I'm gonna hit A, how it switches automatically. Okay, and notice the percentage. That's my battery. Okay, let's see if we can wake this up. Let me just see the S signal. Oops. Okay, that's basically what this mod does. I'm testing it to see how it works. So far, it seems to work fine. But uh, I imagine if you ever do an update again, a firmware update, then this may have to be updated or removed. Okay, how do you install this? I'll demo that one. I should mention uh, number 46 in the menu has been uh, changed. I think it was from Scramble originally. Now I think it's Ulo Power. Oops, let me just go back there. Ulo Power. I'm not sure what it's for, but I imagine it's some sort of uh, output, lower output for certain frequencies. I'll have to figure that out later. But just let you know, this is the version I use, Nick Mod H3 7.9, and it's for firmware 240702. And you just hit download right here. And as you can see, I already installed it using the TED Radio, which was in the downloads. <clears throat> Again, radio's off. You hit the start button. Hold the, the, the button, push to talk. Turn the power on, and once you see the bar moving, release the push to talk. There you go. So. There, it's done. You don't have to push hard, this normal. You don't hold the push to talk through the whole period of time. 
Okay, let me just turn her off, put it back on. Okay, let me, and let's see if I can. Okay, let's redo this again. You hit the blue button, hit the push to talk, and you have the option. Apparently, we can do AM USB with this. Prevent kill um, basically stops you from program, I guess, remotely to, to kill it. Uh, find step, this would be for USB, so I'll have it off right now. Mod hoax, that's to um, allow this uh, mod to work. If there was some sort of um, problem, you can block it. This way, you can still use the radio. Tone monitor will give you the frequency of uh, the transmission. Percentage instead of icon for battery. I like that. Side signal bar style segmented. I like that one. Frequency adjust off. I'm thinking this has to do with offsets, but so I I want this the regular 600 and 1.2. And this is wireless copy. Use the default, so I guess if you're in an area where the default frequency is, there's a lot of uh, interference, you can switch. I like this one, switch VFOs. Okay, hit the orange or red button. Now notice what happens when I hit the B button, how it switches. There's the power output. And, okay, let me see, did I put low power on that one? Yeah, oops, there you go. Low power. There you go. There. Basically same five watts. By watts, there you go. So it's nice, you can see the low and high power. 84% for the battery. I believe something is set in this window here where it says off. Some sort of offset, I think. Maybe it's the for USB, I'm not sure. And again, for signal strength, unfortunately, I'm transmission is so close. But I will try to catch a local station, see what happens. Okay. Okay, this is VA6ALY testing. Yeah. I like that better. Okay, not a radio. Off, off. I'll reload it, Let's hit and start, push. There you go. She's working away. Okay. Turn it off. Unplug this this time. And put it back on. And I go. Locked. There we go. Push talk off. That's what I want. Prevent. That's good. That's good. That's good. Ah, enable one. Percentage. Enable. Segmented. Enabled. Frequency just off. Default. Ah. Switch. Okay. I think it was channel nine. VA six ALY testing. Oops, wrong button. Did I push? Yeah, I pushed the wrong one. VA six ALY testing. Oops. 
Gotta push the buttons, huh? <laughs> Interesting, CT. Off, okay. Carrier tone. Wondering, okay, now I know what that little quarter is. Oh, hopefully I was, it was in focus. 95% battery. Great. Okay, I'm gonna just give you a close-up view of that little corner there where it says off. CT carrier ground tone, I assume. I just off. Just going through some of my frequencies. DCS. CT. CT. Okay. You can see most of them are off. Yeah, just going quickly over it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, I'm going to show you another program. And it's called TD or TIT Station. And let me zoom in on there a little bit. Oops, I can't get in there close enough. Okay. It's on the same site, and it's called uh, TID Station. And I'll show you what it does. Let me just close that. Okay, let me just... I, of course, already downloaded it and zoomed in. And let me get <clears throat> a radio. Use the same cable that you do for programming. This, like this. Yep. Okay. Plug in. Okay, I've used it already. Download. Okay, let me try this again. Oh, it's not on, that's why. <laughs> so many buttons to hit, huh? There you go. It's downloading my settings off this phone. Which so happened, I already did it. Call sign. You have a list. Calibrations, interesting. Numbers. Okay, so that is tuner mod. Okay. Okay, this is the um, FM stations, I think. Okay. Nothing there. This is where you can do a flash or patches. Sure, what this little button does USB, FM, AM. Okay, and let's go back here again. You can save, load, you can load the uh, state, load in a previously saved configuration, and you can save one. And this one here, I can write to the radio. So if you make some changes, I'm not sure what this push to talk. Oh, okay. No, I didn't, didn't see it. Anyways, this is all the settings. It's interesting. Will I be using it? If I do, only be once in a while, I think. Uh, basically, once it's set up one radio, I just use the uh, Wi-Fi wi uh, copy, and it basically works. So, but I thought I'd let, let you know.
it's out there, Kid Station. Might be of interest uh, for some. Okay. It would be appreciated if you subscribe and thumbs up. It's a source of encouragement. Thank you.